This is number four on your dilations practice. It says graph the image of quadrilateral F, G, H, and I after a dilation with a scale factor of one-fifth centered at the origin. So we want to use that scale factor of one-fifth to find our new coordinates for our image. So to begin with, we want to start with what our pre-image coordinates are. So for F, we start here at negative five, negative 10. For G, our pre-image coordinates are going to be negative five, positive 10. For H, we're gonna have zero, negative five. And for I, we're gonna start off at zero, negative 10. So when we start with our pre-image coordinates, we know we're gonna use our scale factor and multiply by whatever our scale factor is to get our image coordinates. So for F, to get to our prime, we're gonna multiply both of those coordinates, the X and Y, by one-fifth. So negative five times one-fifth will give us negative one, and negative 10 times one-fifth will give us negative two. For G prime, we're gonna multiply by one-fifth as well. So negative five times one-fifth will give us negative one, and 10 times one-fifth will give us positive two. For h prime, we're gonna multiply zero times one-fifth, which will give us zero, and negative five times one-fifth, which gives us negative one. And for i prime, we're gonna multiply all of our coordinates with, by one-fifth, so zero times one-fifth will give us zero, and negative 10 times one-fifth will give us negative two. Once we have all our image coordinates, we can go ahead and graph, so for F prime, we're gonna to go to negative one, negative two. So that's our F prime. For G prime, we go to negative one, positive two. And that's our G prime. For H prime, we go to zero, negative one. And for I prime, we go to zero, negative two. Now we can go ahead and connect our points. And remember, this should be the same shape. The only thing that's changing is our size. So we can tell it looks like the same shape, but now our size has changed and it is a reduction because our scale